Alexander Ovechkin. So we had Connor McDavid score with blazing speed. Mm -hmm. Then you have Austin Matthews, who's who's a hybrid. He he's uh, can shoot, he can dish, he can do everything. And then you have Ovechkin, who's just a pure shooter, uh, scores hat trick. What, what do you know? You how do? far down Ovechkin went in fantasy pools this year? Oh, I know, amazing. Like it was. Look where he's gone in the top fifty players. I know. in the game. But but last night I sensed a rejuvenation a little bit with him with the the Verana kid, mm -hmm. Kuznetsov. All of a sudden there was a little bit of give and go and some you know it looked like a pretty impressive line and he seemed to relish at this guy. So maybe is there a little pressure off him? I don't know. But what do you think? Is I there like, pressure off him? I, I think no. no. I think the pressure will be on as the season progresses, but. I just sensed he seemed to be on a bit of a high last night with that line. I think that th I have this team doing well in the playoffs this year because the pressure is off them, that they've everybody believes they've missed their window and, and maybe if they, they can overachieve. They they just have to get a year where they don't have to play Pittsburgh in the second round. Well, that's not going to that's never going to yeah. happen. The, yeah, you know the way. Well, unless the, Pittsburgh that, lose in the first round. Well, but you I know, mean, you, I don't. I have Pittsburgh going all the way to the final again. So, so does that mean they're going to be there? Who, Washington? No, Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh yeah. Because you have them going there. Yeah. You think they can win 11-10 every night? <laughs> they're going to have to right now. <laughs> but but and, seriously. Or hope Matt Murray doesn't get hurt. You know, when you really look back at the Washington Capitals and how many times they've had to play Pittsburgh in that second round. Sure. You know, it's a, it's a tough, pretty tough assignment. So what do you do with the... It, it, you got to get changed, division change. No, I... I the, to me, you know, we did a thing for Sportsnet.ca. Who are the guys on the hot seat? I think the guy on the hottest seat this year in the National Hockey League is Barry Trotz. Doesn't have a contract after this year, uh, you know. And they're, you know, they could have, they could, have, they could have signed him right now. He deserves another contract. Why, why hasn't it happened? And I think that you know, there's a lot of people within the organization saying, "Hey, listen, this is the year. We have this is." The window is closing with this group of guys, particularly with a guy like Ovechkin, and you, we better do something. You know, they went out and... Last year was the year, to, or John. That's right. They, they went out and tr they did everything in their power last year to beef up for the Stanley Cup playoffs, and they failed. So this time around, I think, I think it's a huge year for the Caps. Holpe. Well, look where, you know... That's, that's, their, that's their guy now. It's, it's gone from Ovechkin... Now Holtby has to get them through.